Our solar system is a familiar neighborhood, planets, asteroids, comets, all orbiting the sun in predictable paths, but in 2017, something extraordinary happened. A visitor from another star system streaked through our cosmic backyard. Astronomers in Hawaii spotted it first and named it Oumuamua, meaning a messenger from afar, arriving first. This was the first confirmed object from interstellar space, a true pioneer, likely journeying for millions of years. Its path was a giveaway. Unlike anything in our solar system, Oumuamua followed a hyperbolic trajectory, just passing through, never to return. The discovery electrified scientists. For centuries we'd theorized such objects existed, but never seen one. Its arrival confirmed that the cosmos is a connected place, where fragments from distant star systems can visit others. But there was a catch. By the time the Pan-STARRS telescope spotted it, Oumuamua had already swung past the sun and was speeding away. It was like glimpsing a rare bird just as it flies out of sight. Every telescope scrambled to catch a look, but our visitor was already vanishing. This fleeting encounter left us with more questions than it answers. We had only a brief window to study a piece of another world. The mystery of Oumuamua would captivate scientists and the public alike. Its brief visit marked the beginning of a cosmic puzzle that would take years to unravel. Because Oumuamua was discovered so late, our view was limited to a faint fast-moving speck. Imagine trying to photograph a pebble thrown across a football field at night, just a blurry streak. All we had was the sunlight it reflected, but even that told a strange story. Its brightness swung wildly every few hours, hinting at a bizarre shape, perhaps ten times longer than it was wide. Artists imagined a tumbling cosmic cigar or a flat pancake, spinning end over end. Its reddish color suggested it had been tanned by cosmic rays for millions of years. But the real shock was its movement. As it left the sun, it sped up slightly, as if pushed by an invisible hand. Normally, comets accelerate this way by outgassing, ice turning to gas and creating a tail. But Oumuamua showed no coma, no tail, no visible outgassing at all. It was accelerating without a visible engine. Scientists were left with only data points and wild speculation. No clear image. Just hints and mysteries. Illustrations filled the gap, showing a dark, tumbling object in the void. For years, these artists' impressions were all we had. The lack of answers only deepened the intrigue. Umamua became the ultimate cosmic enigma. Its secrets were locked away, just out of reach. Umuamua's strange acceleration sparked fierce debate. Was it a comet outgassing invisible substances, like hydrogen or nitrogen, or a fluffy porous object pushed by sunlight? Some proposed it was a nitrogen iceberg, chipped from a distant exoplanet. Then came the sensational theory, what if it was artificial, a solar sail or alien probe? Most scientists leaned toward natural explanations, but the lack of data kept speculation alive. Without more evidence, the true nature of Oumuamua remained a tantalizing mystery. For years, Oumuamua's mystery seemed unsolvable. It was gone, far beyond our reach. But then came the James Webb Space Telescope, humanity's most powerful eye on the cosmos. With its giant golden mirror and infrared vision, JWST could spot the faintest, coldest objects. Astronomers knew if any telescope could find Oumuamua again, it was JWST. The odds were slim. Oumuamua was now a cold, dark speck in deep space. Still, scientists pointed JWST at a tiny patch of sky in Pegasus, hoping for a miracle. Hundreds of hours of observation followed, collecting every photon from that direction. It was a long shot, but the world watched and waited. Could JWST finally solve the mystery? The search pushed technology and patience to their limits. The answer would change everything we knew about interstellar visitors. In autumn 2025 the news broke, JWST had found Oumuamua. After an unprecedented observation, it detected the faint heat signature of our interstellar visitor. For the first time, we had a real image, not just a blurry dot or an artist's guess. The image showed a small faint object but it was enough to reveal crucial details. Oumuamua was not a sleek cigar, but a flattened, irregular, pancake-like shard. Its elongated shape matched earlier predictions, but its form was more splinter than missile. JWST's spectrograph revealed a mottled surface, patches of dark and light material. Most importantly, it detected water ice mixed with complex carbon molecules. This was the smoking gun. Oumuamua was a natural object. 
not an alien artifact. The presence of water ice explained its mysterious acceleration. Weak outgassing, invisible to earlier telescopes, had gently pushed it. The object's rotation was complex, wobbling like a spinning plate knocked off balance. This hinted at a violent past, perhaps a collision or tidal forces in its home system. The image was a triumph, turning years of speculation into hard evidence. Umamua was no longer a ghost, but a tangible piece of another world. The mystery was finally giving way to understanding. Science had caught up with imagination. The universe had shared one of its secrets. With JWST's data, the puzzle pieces fell into place, the alien artifact theory faded, the evidence pointed to a natural origin, water ice and organic molecules explained the acceleration, weak dustless outgassing invisible to old telescopes, its flattened shard-like shape suggested a violent birth, ripped from a larger body by tidal forces, the complex wobble fit this story, a fragment sent tumbling by catastrophe. Umuamua was a water-rich carbon-dark shard, baked by cosmic rays, awakened by our sun. Its journey was epic, but its story was rooted in familiar cosmic processes. The mystery was solved, but the wonder remained. Umuamua's story is more than a cosmic mystery, it's the dawn of a new science. Interstellar objects let us study other planetary systems up close, not just our own. Each visitor is a sample from another star, carrying clues about alien worlds. JWST's discovery of water and carbon on Oumuamua suggests life's building blocks are common across the galaxy. These objects hint that planetary systems exchange material, maybe even the seeds of life itself. The idea of panspermia, life traveling between stars, suddenly feels possible. Interstellar visitors connect us to the wider cosmos, showing we're part of a galactic ecosystem. As our telescopes improve, we'll find more of these messengers. Each one is a postcard from a distant star, reminding us we're not alone. The universe is full of stories waiting to be discovered.